what inspired you to start afco because i was reading up a little you're not from the world of environmental science or engineering you studied finance and accounting how did afco then happen growing up i always was tinkering with a lot of electronics uh, i would open up my video cassette player i would you know think about the computer i assembled my first computer at the age of 11 but uh, as technologically inclined i was uh, i don't think uh, the formal education that it requires uh, No, I didn't have the dedication to kind of pursue that, but it was always something that the back of my head that I wanted to do. Um, I was lucky enough to be born into a business family, and in you know the first early years of my career, I got to dabble in a lot of businesses. Um, I ran a hotel, I acquired a steel rolling mill, um, I ran the export business, but technology was something that always was a void. And in 2016, actually, I had uh, just exited my steel business partially, and I wasn't in control anymore. so i thought this is probably the perfect time to pursue something in technology and i wanted to do something with regards to sustainability and water did seem like a very ignored sector yeah and the more research i did and understood that you know there are ways to capture humidity from the air to make water um i just thought i don't know i discovered that a way to fix all my childhood dreams and my tinkering habits all at once